What's up? Party people in the house tonight. I didn't realize I left my stream up. I just wanted to apologize to you guys. Uh, didn't have time to stream, but right here on the beautiful road. Let's see if I can this camera now. Let's see if anybody jumps on. Oh, yeah, that's better. See if we're getting anybody to jump in here. <laughs> yes, holler if anybody comes in. What's up? What's up, King? I ain't no king, that's for sure. Just driving through the cornfields. About time. Yeah, a little late. Alan Kaufman. Turtle Poop. Tool Demos. Uh, Chris Friedman. Driving down a two lane. Me and Henry. Oh, that didn't work. Driving down a two lane. Trying to get you guys a. Uh, little view. Let's see if I can show you where I'm going here. Camera. There we go. Just driving through the beautiful cornfields of Iowa. Me and the old Subaru and Henry, Henry's son. Sorry about last night, guys. I do apologize. I'm heading to uh, the races up in uh, Britt, Iowa right now. Me and Henry. Me and Henry Dog. I'm going to watch School Bus Demolition Derby. My weekend's going pretty good. I, got, I had some stuff going on last night. And I just couldn't make it to the live. So I figured on my way up to the... Uh, races today i would uh whoop i would uh maybe hit the live stream see if you guys could hear me and see me and while i was going down the, the small two lane i'd take the interstate up to here so it is what it is so thought i'd jump on here for a little bit kind of give you guys a live road tour Yeah, me and, me and CP, yeah, J.D. Deco called me, and uh, I was like, yeah, I, I had a sewer line break, and uh, I was just not, uh, I was just worn out last night, so. Yeah, this is going to be a cool one, so I'm going to get some video of this uh, school bus race for you guys. I got a bunch of other, I got trailer races, I got a whole bunch of stuff. I've hit, like, six county fairs the last two weeks i'm on this roll i'm on this kick just and hey, this is what's central iowa besides the chicken farms off in the distance um I, it just smells like hell right up here right now you guys are glad you don't have smell of vision just a beautiful day 82 degrees we have had absolutely amazing weather for the end of july the fair is right around the corner so it'll get it'll get nice and spicy Thank you, uh, David. Trying to read a few things. So, going out next week. Uh, yeah, we did do the best show for two hours. I think J.D. Tico needs to have a live stream, and uh, me and him need to have another chat again on live stream. I'll tell you what. We talk about some stuff that's pretty cool. Um, between my outside life, beside... Uh, working on cars and you know business and stuff like that it's uh it's definitely an interesting conversation yeah did you not see you should go look at his post if you haven't seen how many he had like his whole door uh smoked up oh yeah look at that over there. look at that look at those quants and 
Them old quantum huts kill me. This is a flatter road here in Iowa, I will say that. But uh, it is beautiful nonetheless. The beans are looking good. The beans will start potting out here next month, I suppose. Henry is just tickled to be in the car. Had a busy week. What's up, David Dallas? Smoke blower. I just I had a sewer line break last night. And uh, well I had a sewer line break. I thought I had it fixed and then last night it ruptured again. I'm waiting for parts because just like everything else, this is uh, it is what it is. So I just didn't feel like coming on. And uh, it was 9.30 before I was all wrapped up with stuff, and it is what it is. No big deal. So I figured I'd come on here, and I see my live was still up. Somebody messaged me and said my live was still up, so I thought, oh, I better come on here and say howdy to you guys. Look at that corn! I mean, it is the end of July, and it's already really tough. That stuff don't start tasseling. I mean, I can't, I don't even understand anymore. You know, it's just crazy. They're bailing ditches. Because the hay's been, or it's been so dry this year, I'm sure hair patients are going to be all over the place. So that's why you see these guys bailing hay in the ditches here. Because it's going to be, hay is going to skyrocket this year. So when hay skyrockets, these guys break out their hay equipment. Otherwise, they don't bother. You never see this hay in the ditches, you know, unless it's unless they're doing that. They're going to make piles of money. Yeah, Henry's got a little issue, too, we came up with this week, unfortunately. Um, I'll talk about that some other time. But uh, Henry's going to have uh, have to probably have some surgery, unfortunately. Buy them. Uh, Capri torque wrenches. But um, what's up, Eric? Work some tools. Tim Windsor, uh, sorry guys if I don't see you. One, two, three, Don Master, trying to take a quick look here. Alan Kaufman, been to the Combine. Uh, oh, yeah, camp, Combine derbies are awesome, Alan. Uh, yeah, I apologize. I won't be able to see you guys' comments that great. So, uh, just yell really loud, and I'll hear you. I wish they, I wish they did have sound. I wish I had an option for sound for YouTube where you guys could just talk back to me. That would be so much cooler. I have to make you guys type. Let's see. Do I got to turn here? This is Eagle Grove. I need to go up to Clarion. So, yeah, we're up. This is a big chicken farm right here. Yeah, big chicken outfit right there. You guys don't know, I was got just a – I think we're one of the top ten chicken egg, egg producers in the United States, which never used to be, but now it is. But – Holy green bin. The storm head up here. Yeah, this is their like main receiving centrum. Centrum Valley Farms. <coughs> I went down to the uh, Mountain Dew tour. There's all the egg farm there you get there the buildings right there. Just stupid amounts. I went down to the Mountain Dew tour. Uh to the skate park in Des Moines here today for a little bit before I started heading up here. That was cool to see, man. Really, really cool uh, deal. Um, I did donate to the uh, uh, deal they were doing there. It was really cool. A uh, lot of lot of amputees and special needs, or not special needs, but a lot of amputees and a lot of uh, um, uh, visual. There was a there was two guys skating in that deal that were blind. I was absolutely blown away. I love uh, action uh, action sports. I mean, I'm, I'm, I was always grew up around motocross and stuff like that. So that skate park uh, thing was absolutely so cool to see. I could not believe to see those guys were skating with uh, the head sticks. I, if you guys get a chance, go and look at uh, Mountain Dew Tour on my uh, community page. I tagged them there and uh, go watch their uh, live feed. Uh, it was absolutely awesome.
Uh, let me see here. So I turned the camera back. You guys had enough of looking at looking at the roadside. You want to see my ugly mug now again? Hello. Oh, just the smell of chicken shit around here. It almost smells like outside of Portland, Oregon. Or Los Banos. Maybe Redwoods. Uh, actually, there is if you have a phone to put. Yeah, I guess you could speak to text, but I can't hear it. Oh, I can't. Yeah, the speak to text won't work on the, uh, uh, for the chat, no. Capri, Pro, I love it. CP, awesome channel. Thank you, Mike. Uh, smells like money. Yeah, there you go. Smells like lots of money. Egg money. I'm not a fan of chickens, guys. I don't. You know? I've never been a bird guy. Hogs? Cows? Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Give you guys a quick deal. We'll see how long this lasts. I'm right. Should be good service here. Henry is just loving it. Can you guys hear me good? Sun ain't bothering you too much. Need to pass this guy, but I just don't want to. Yeah, Justin, uh, so far so good. Chicken farm. Paper Miller chicken farm. Now, I'll be honest with you, tool demos, the worst smell that I've ever smelled is a uh, hide place, hide tanning place we have here in Boone, Iowa, where they tan the hides. Oh, my lanta. It is absolutely, uh, I can't remember what it's called, something trading or something like that. Holy smokes, dude. That that made a guys, that made me nauseous. Not even joking you one bit. All right, let's see what we got here. We got time. Going to Clarion. Five miles of Clarion. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Probably going to stay off this. Our fellow with the dually and the little trailer turned off. We're going to be going away from the sun for a little bit, so that's nice. We got a four way stop, so we get to go. Oh yeah, look at that. Now we're in now we're in the end of the, we're driving right into the sun. Oh my god, dude. I'll tell you what, I can handle a tanning. I can handle a pig farm, but that freaking that freaking uh all out destruction, seven PM Hancock. We're a little late. We're getting a little behind. Can smell them burning. Oh my God, burning monkeys! Oh my God, I could not do that. Burning monkeys! Wow, that sounds terrible. So yeah, sorry I didn't have time. I'm gonna be up here all day or all evening, and then I got a two-hour drive back home. And then I got a antique tractor pull in the morning go to so we are uh we're flying all over iowa i think we'll probably be down next weekend we won't have a whole lot going on i don't know i'm just i'm taking it all in fellas as much as i can do these things are great the old subaru is turning out 24 miles a gallon which is awesome and then gas prices drop down here to about 350 a gallon so that's awesome. So it was like perfect timing. What a feller needs to do is just head up north somewhere where it's even cool, cooler. Go check out some territory up there. 
about the perfect time of year to go up to the northern area. So, this should be exciting. They got bus, they got tough truck. There's just a whole bunch of violent amounts of stuff. So, so anyways, guys, I think that uh, I gave you an update, a little quick one. You guys can check out, and uh, I'm going to hop off here before somebody sees me driving around with a phone in my hand. Oh, wow, 33 in your Subaru? That's amazing. This is a four-speed, and it's an old... Uh, Mine's a 2003, so it's an old gem, but I was pretty tickled with 24 considering I was driving around with 10 to 15 in my pickup, so I'm okay with that. So, But I'm going to jump off here, fellas. Tool grabber gets 32. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, w I, w I used to get 27 in my Chrysler, but my 300, but uh, yeah. Anyways, fellas, I'm going to jump off here, though. I uh, just wanted to make sure I get an update so that way you guys didn't think I said I couldn't respond to all the messages. But I appreciate you guys with all your concerns and uh, comments and questions and whatnot. I had to get back to everybody, but, uh, you know, we'll uh, we'll hammer down here we can. So, all right, fellas, y'all keep her greasy side down. We'll catch you on the next one. Later.